Hey, what is up, my B-Boss baddies and my Batman fellas? It is your girl, Bosana, and welcome, B-Boss Army. So, as you guys can tell, yes, I am back with this video, and I'm saying it as it's exciting. You guys have been waiting for this one, and honestly, I just kind of slowed down because I was dropping so much videos around this topic, and so I'm so sorry for the holdup. I'm here now, okay? So, please go ahead and give this video a huge thumbs up. If you do want another version, let me know. I do have two other channels. Links down below. Hello, are y'all ready? Now, if you don't like anything that's crazy, sexual, you don't like that type of talk, you don't like real talk, and you're not grown enough, if you're not 18 plus, please tune out right now, okay? Okay, ready? All right, so just to give you guys a good heads up quickly, if you haven't watched my other videos, one great example, just to give you guys a good, clear thought, was um, girls want to give you top, hey, um, when you pull over, they want you to pull over and tell them to do it or while you're driving. So with those examples, those are more while you're dating or maybe a girl that's not your girlfriend or if she's your girlfriend, she'll just ask. But those examples kind of go for everybody. Now I'm just talking real, real, real deep sexual things. So it's not those basic, you know, things. Those are basic minor things, outside things. This is all indoor things that I'm talking about. So I hope you guys can handle it. First thing on my list is that a woman, a secret thing a woman wants to go ahead and have you do is smack 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 that that ex <laughs> smack that booty yes okay so y'all this is one of the huge secrets out here that women just fail completely fail to tell men that they want and they do this because they don't want it to seem like okay well i need you to take control or i need you to be that aggressive with me now it's two reasons sometimes it could be because she's just shy and so she doesn't want to tell you what she actually wants and then she could just be expecting you as a man you know to be aggressive like that and y'all just don't mind these marks i know it looks really bad but i was working out and um the sports bra that i was wearing had a metal piece a nike metal piece right here that was literally just scraping scratching me so we're here now so don't mind it i know it looks really bad i'm trying to hide it but it is what it is so um back to what i'm saying she could be shy right and so that's one reason why a woman will not go ahead and tell you be aggressive like that but you have to keep in mind that every woman has that freaky side so if she has that side that means at the end of the day she needs to see you go ahead and deliver and deliver in the way of showing you are the man that can take over now if there's a time where a woman wants you know less aggressiveness that's cool but a woman and honestly in my opinion should never want to be the leader in the bedroom now i'm not saying a girl can't you know ride you and all that stuff i actually have the next point kind of has to do with that but i'm just trying to say that a woman loves when you can be aggressive and she doesn't ask you she wants you to go ahead and show her so another reason why a girl doesn't that's the second reason she won't go ahead and tell you i need you to smack smack that is because she thinks that you would go ahead and do that yourself right you would think that this booty is here it's fat it's sitting it's in your face and you would go ahead and take full advantage to go ahead and do something with that cake and so it's kind of also giving her a validation and i know you guys are always thinking you know never validate never validate but honestly there's great times that you can and this is when you guys are getting this type of intimate so this is obviously when you're in the bedroom but listen if you guys are hanging out and let's say she gets up and you know she's already showing up and don't even act like these girls are not showing up if she's coming with leggings making that booty sit right right she's showing less she's hanging out with you actually spending time with you she cannot say that she's not really into you and she's not she's not going to be able to get in that mood she will get in that mood and this is what i was also telling you guys before that you could put that woman in that mood so remember that she might not tell you what she wants to do she might not tell you these things it's going to be a secret but if you have it in you, most fellas that have confidence and that aren't scared, they'll go ahead and show this side. So I do really want to keep going, but I want to make sure you guys get all the information, especially for those who don't watch until the end. So the last thing I'll just say with this point to wrap up, that smackiness, it just gives that girl that, oh man, what a man. Like just the fact that you can grip, the grip also shows that, okay, you know what? You're that type of man, keep grabbing. So there's so many different things I wanna say, so many different ways and all these things, but I'm not gonna do that in this video because you guys are gonna be like, Bosana, you know, get to the next point. But if you guys do want me to elaborate on this point, let me know. And it's a crazy thing that just gets that girl like, mm, don't even touch me, but she loves it and she wants more of it. And y'all just remember, when she comes set up already for that D or as 
if she's in that she's gonna get in that mood she's really about to get in that mood all you have to do is push the right buttons so if she already does the part of wearing leggings wearing a you know that type of hand y'all know where i'm going with that she's dressed a certain way has a certain vibe she's you know her presence is open her body language is giving you okay come close y'all gotta take full advantage and full control because that's the time where you can push that button and get that side to show and she can go ahead and show you how much of those secret things she's been wanting to explore okay and now let's go ahead and move on but i will elaborate next video talk to her disrespectful now i know this sounds wild and i'm not promoting you know talking to a woman disrespectful i'm not promoting that form but i'm for pump <laughs> sorry but i'm promoting it in the bedroom because this is where it gets so fun and wild now if we want to be children and want to act like oh that's being too aggressive oh no a woman can't do that listen how do you think girls can't handle it run from the d and come right back or get pulled back why do you think girls get deep with why do girls come right back to guys they don't tell these guys most of the time the secret things that they want you know those freaky little things no what they're doing is going ahead and letting that guy do those things that he would maybe do with other girls or knows what's best. Maybe he knows game or maybe, you know, she, she could kind of give you those signs and think that you will know by that direction, by that sign that she gave you what to do next. And so really to simplify what I was just saying is that y'all got to get that girls want a lot of stuff that they'll never tell you. But this is the stuff that guys are already saying to do. These are stuff that guys are doing. And I say this to say that why or maybe you guys have that friend that is always getting that girl or maybe you know somebody that's always getting girls and it's like wow i don't get it dude your your attitude is disgusting bro <laughs> right your, your your body language you know i don't know girls girls love you but hey i don't get it and that's what they love the disrespect the rude guys and so it means you gotta apply it there's gonna be little secret things that they keep that will apply to those things that guys are doing in the real world doing every day to day so talking to her disrespectful, I said in the past that, you know, girls want you to talk to them dirty. Absolutely. That's one big fact. But now we're talking on a whole nother level. Now, this disrespectfulness is not to say that you need to call her a B and stuff like that. It's to bring her in that freak mode, that freak zone. And when you do that, you're going to say things such as, you know, I'm not going to really get into too much details. I'm going to save it because I want to save this video um, so I can elaborate on a lot of these points. But one example for you guys, it could be like, oh, um, and this might sound a little weird, but listen to me. Oh, you know, let me see if that thing can really move. Now, that is just one thing that a guy has said before like and i'm not saying for my for my own experience this is something i've heard plenty of time excuse me plenty of whoa i choked there plenty of time <coughs> i need water <laughs> plenty of times so for you guys don't take it as an oh my gosh i'm being rude or no a girl wouldn't want that no she's gonna go ahead and show you what that thing can do that thing back her back there that thing that's sitting right she's gonna show you what it could do and this is why girls will you know have a good time or enjoy herself around a man because they start getting validation from the tough guys now they can start getting it out when they start getting cute or they start showing certain things so really i'm trying to say to you guys just with this point so we can move on finally i guess some people will say that but you guys might think it's like the worst thing to do or not the best thing to do at all but Here's the thing. Girls will entertain those guys that are disrespectful and that I don't have to prove. You guys already see it out in the streets. Y'all see it with the woman already nowadays what's going on with these females. So now for you fellas, what you guys got to do is play that role. Like I said, close doors, right? Now it's one-on-one -on -one time. When you guys go ahead and do that, you're basically trying to test her. You're basically trying to say, I see it in you. You're basically making that woman feel like, okay, I can show you what, what I could do with it. Right. And so when you talk to her disrespectful, it's more of like, oh, I'm putting you to the test. It's more of like, are you really about it? Right. And so that's where a lot of men can go ahead and use the teasing and all these different methods and strategies that will go ahead and and get this world, this world, this girl to show you this, this other side of, of her, a new world that you guys would have never thought because these secrets, like I said, they don't tell you. So if you guys get afraid that, oh, I'm not going to tell her to take it, right? That's another great one. And y'all, I promise I'll do a part two. Another great one, telling her to take it. That's That might be disrespectful. You guys might be like, oh, that's too mean. How are you going to tell her to take it? No, you got to tell her. She, she wants to take it, and that's what gets her excited. Y'all, how does a girl get stimulated down there? She has to get excited, okay? I'll elaborate, you guys. Last thing on my list is going ahead telling her. She wants you, telling you guys. This is a secret thing that girls want. They want you to go ahead and tell her, 
come and ride this d <laughs> Now, this could have been in one of my other videos, but this actually falls into this category because a lot of girls actually want you to do this. And this is telling her to come back over here and do that. Now, first thing, in my teasing video, I've told you guys in that video, literally gave you guys examples of what you can say to get that girl to come over and do what you want her to do. I already said that in those videos, so watch it. And it works, I'm telling you guys. So now, the other thing about telling her to come and ride this, you guys might be like, okay, that might turn her off or make her run away. Of course, like I've said, make sure it's in the mood. Right time, right mood setting, everything is correct, right? But y'all ask, y'all also have to remember this applies at the end. This is where things really, really are at that point where it's getting steamy, it's getting hot. This is your chance. So of course, I saved this for the last because you guys gotta save it for the last. But what I do wanna say is I do have a little cough, you guys. Can I get it out? Okay, please don't mind it. <coughs> it was really bad, but I had to get it out. It was just really like, <coughs> I'm sorry. I just recovered from sickness. Okay, and this last thing that I wanted to go ahead and finish off to say is that you going ahead and telling her to ride that, ride this, come on it. Y'all got to get that. A lot of these women want you to go ahead and do, do that so she can show you what she's about. Sometimes girls get excited just to show what she can bring. Now, I know sometimes it's like, oh, that's impossible. Or girls never bring anything to the table. Or they don't get excited. Or they don't really, you know, show anything that they could bring to the table. But in all reality, when it comes down, especially to the bedroom, that's when girls are willing to because it's way more easier than, you know, her bringing to the table in other areas. Right? Y'all have to remember, girls are maintaining their looks and their body so if there's gonna be a time a chance for her to go ahead and show you all this right show you what she got show you this other side you know go ahead and show you that hey she could really ride right she will do it but i'm not saying she's gonna do it just for any guy no this is where the other stuff will go ahead and apply where how can you get it the first time or how can you get it going again with your your girlfriend that you've been with for years or getting it going again with that ex y'all gotta know that there's the teasing like i said and a whole bunch of other stuff that you gotta make sure you're applying to when you're doing these things because if you just jump into it and you just tell her oh well come do this or you're trying to do all these other things because hey you heard from bosana oh these are the things that girls just love and they want from you guys y'all will fail and these girls will be scared okay so i want to wrap up to say that yes these are the secrets you know freaky things that girls don't want you to know because they don't tell you but they do want you to do yes it's that but there's other things that you guys will figure out and will know to do yourself and that's going to be based on your personality your charisma who you are that's where you can come out and bring that side of you whether it's quirky kinky it doesn't matter that's where some girls actually really fall hard or some girls learn to fall in love with your flaws now i'm not saying don't bring something crazy or you know show a wow 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 no no i'm saying that that based on the girl how comfortable you guys are getting how things are moving then you'll know then okay you know what i'm gonna start moving this way with this woman okay so i hope this video was really helpful if you guys do have more questions let me know leave your comments down below and that's that you guys will see me in my next video bye guys